Weighted average cost of capital, WAC, measures a company's cost to borrow money given the proportional amounts of each type of debt and equity a company has taken on. A company's debt and equity, or its capital structure, might include common stock, preferred stock, and bonds. WAC is used internally by a company's management as part of determining whether it would be profitable for the company to finance a new project. It is also used by investors as one way to value the company's shares and decide whether to invest. The higher the WAC, the less likely it is the company is creating value because it has to overcome more expensive borrowing costs in order to make a profit. Mary is considering an investment in John's gyms. She determines that the company is producing a 10% return and calculates that the company's WAC is 8%. By subtracting the WAC from the return, she sees that for every dollar John's gym spends, it creates two cents of value. If John's gyms had a whack of 15%, it would be destroying five cents of value for every dollar it invested. If its whack were 10%, the company would be neither creating nor destroying value, but remaining stagnant. Mary thinks she might pass on this investment because while the company is creating value, it's not creating as much as she'd like to see. However, WAC is just one of several tools she uses to evaluate her potential investment. The formula to calculate WAC is WAC equals E over V times RE plus D over V times RD times 1 minus TC, where RE equals cost of equity, RD equals cost of debt, E market value of the firm's equity, D market value of the firm's debt, V equals E plus D, E over V equals percentage of financing that is equity, D over V equals percentage of financing that is debt, TC equals corporate tax rate. Because the WAC formula is so complicated, many investors don't look at this measure, and two investors that perform the calculation for the same company might come up with different results. To simplify the work, however, Investors can use an online WAC calculator.